comrades, Commissar Bro here today with Superpower 2, another mod spotlight. That's right, ladies and gentlemen. This time, we're doing the man in the high castle. That's right. The man in the high castle is a book. It's the uh, alternate history book, where essentially the Germans won World War II. As you can see, the mod takes place in 1964. And uh, the Greater German Reich is absolutely ginormous. And look at that! Look at that! With 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 some serious expenses on their plate. So yeah, basically, if you're gonna play as the Greater German Reich, uh, you're gonna want to get your act your absolutely crippling amount of expenses under control before you do anything uh, extremely serious. Oh, you know, stuff like that. So, yes, we're going to do that. And we're going to get rid of some of the propaganda. Anyway, but I'm not here to play it. I'm just here to show it. As you can see, we have the greater... Uh, well, excuse me. We have Great Britain under our control, which could be annexed at any time. Um, the Germans have control of a whole bunch of stuff, really. Iceland, Greenland. This whole area here is basically under control of Germany. I'm kind of surprised they didn't get control of Finland or Sweden. I guess they allowed them to remain sovereign states or something. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. And then you've got Italy, the Kingdom of Italy, who has taken over this whole area here. I'm surprised that they don't have control of Libya or Egypt or any of those regions, really. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Anyway. All right. And then you've got the Imperial Empire of Japan. That just that seems redundant <laughs> who has even more crippling expenses look at that debt oh Jesus I wouldn't want to have to deal with that uh, if I was them but as you can see the Imperial Empire of Japan has pretty much most of the minor islands in the Pacific they also control all of China Mongolia uh, and you know Tibet that region and all the way up into Alaska that's right now, another really big difference is the United States is only these four states anymore. So they have really been brought to heel. Um, and then you've got the German States of America, yeah, which is uh, seems to be doing pretty well for itself, considering it's got one of those powerful armies in the world and uh, is pretty damn rich with actually a positive balance and resources. And then you've got the Pacific States of America. That's right. So there's a whole bunch of stuff going on here in this particular mod. Those are the main changes. Is uh, what the, what I just showed you. Um, basically, it would seem like you would want to play against the Greater German Reich um, and try to overcome them. A lot of the European countries have been pretty much eliminated. So it seems like your your best the most fun you would probably get out of this mod is uh, trying to bring down the Greater German Reich, or at least that's what I would want to do, is uh, try to find a way to bring them down. Uh, so, yeah, yeah. I imagine you could try doing that with, like, the Kingdom of Italy um, or the Greater States of America or the Pacific States of America, but I don't know if I would want to do it with anybody else because everyone else is very, very small compared to these guys. I mean, look at that landmass. But more specifically, look at that army. That army is like twice the size of the American army and just vanilla superpower too. So, <laughs> like, that's kind of ri ridiculously large. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so I noticed there hasn't been any unique units put in yet. That would be interesting if they actually added in some uh, unique units. Yeah, that would kind of change it up a bit if I do say so myself. Mm -hmm. Anyway, so yes, this is the Man in the High Castle mod. It looks pretty interesting, I'm sure. It could be a lot of fun. Um, again, I'm all for alternate history-esque mods. Those can always be fun. Um, I, I was about to say, even on what, Making History the Great War, that the, the mod that I kind of made there is just like an alternate history mod. Just a bunch of nonsensical factions fighting for dominance. So yeah, 
you know, this could be really cool. And uh, from what I see so far, it, it's one of the better alternate history mods. There's already unique flags uh, for each faction, which is a big, big deal. Especially, I, ca I really like that Greater German Reich flag. That looks pretty cool. I like the coloring on it and whatnot. Ooh, and then that German States. Yeah, so there's, there's, there's definitely been a lot of work put into this mod thus far. So it would be kind of interesting to see it supported further. But anyway, this is Kamisaburo, and I'll see all you beautiful people next time.